Hi, in this video I will show how to convert DBF file, Spro DBF file to a SQLite DBA, the database file. Uh, this is my website, I will leave link to the site in the description. To find the app, I will type in search DBF to SQLite, click on page, double click on download button to start downloading process. Click on downloaded archive and double click on MSI to start installation. Click on more info here. I'm getting the screen from Windows because I'm not registered publisher. You can see publisher unknown. I'll just click run anyway to start installation. Click on next, next install. Click on yes here and click on finish. An app will be installed on my computer and shortcut, new shortcut will be on my desktop. Now I can close this and minimize this and double click on shortcut to launch app. Now conversion is like three steps process. On first step I have to select file I want to convert. Let's go and select states, uh, file. So this is DBF file, I can show it to you. I have a DBF viewer, it's another app that just shows what in DBF. I will leave a link on this app in description too. So basically it shows what is inside DBF columns. We have state name, state, code, region, subregion. It contains all US states um, inside. So I will select the state DBF, click on next step. On next step I'll have to specify do I want this DBF to be placed into new SQLite file or into existing SQLite file. If I have to, I can select existing but I have to select in which SQLite file I want this data to be saved. So, new SQLite is okay for this test, I'll click just next step and click on run to start conversion. Now it will ask me uh, name of the file and location, Na this name and location is okay, I'll just click save. And it will say states created, states is the name of the DPF, so it will be states table, 50 rows imported for, uh, because there are 50 states in and this is the name of SQLite. I can go and open this SQLite. I have another app that for view SQLite file. I can open this SQLite viewer. I will leave a link on this app too. Click on set agreement. And now it will show me SQLite it, with all uh, columns from DBF here. Uh, so yeah, basically that's it. Uh, I have SQLite file I wanted. I can select multiple, multiple DBF files, and they will all be placed into one SQLite file as a different tables with all data in it. So yeah, basically that's it. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. Thank you.